Welcome to One Minute IT, where I show you how to do something technical in one minute or less. From a Windows computer, we can type the word trace router, trace RT. If you're using Macintosh or Linux, you would spell out the entire word trace route with an E at the end. After that, it's followed by an IP address or a fully qualified domain name, such as a website address. And I'll just go ahead and press enter. And here you can see all the different hops it takes. These are all the different routers that it's bouncing off of to get from my source to the destination. Now, sometimes you're gonna see it get hung up with one of those stars. That means it either timed out or there's some other hiccup along the way. Typically, we do a trace route in case we can't reach one of our destinations, say websites or other online resource. And we need to find out where it's getting hung up. I also like to do the minus D command because it goes a little faster and it doesn't try to resolve all the names as you see here. And sometimes we can use this to find out how many hops it takes to get to our DNS server. Thanks for joining me on One Minute IT.